Well, Spokane International is raising the fees that it charges taxis and shuttles to drop off passengers at the airport. KXY4 Jeff Humphrey working for you. He's aboard one of those express shuttles. Your travels, Jeff. Nadine, this is one of those off-site airport parking companies that will valley park your car, they'll load all your luggage onto a van like this one, and then they'll drop you off at the curb. However, this company is competing with the airport's parking lots, and so travelers may feel the impact of those higher fees. Every time Juan Contreras drops off or picks up passengers at Spokane International, his shuttle service gets charged a fee. This transponder on his windshield keeps track of the trips that he makes around the terminal. It's clocked as we drive in the airport. It triggers um, their ground transportation system, lets us know that we've entered the airport. It charges us. Currently, it's charging us 50 cents. And 30 days from now, it's going to go to a dollar per trip. While a dollar a trip doesn't sound like much, after the rates are doubled in July, Spotted Road Express will be paying $800 a month. Contreras says his family-owned three-employee company can't afford the hit. It's, it's a big challenge for us to pay such a big increase in so little time. All the while we're being undercut and, and, to, and our ability to pass the cost on or to raise our fees is being taken away from us. Contreras says he can't pass on the cost to his customers because the airport has dropped its North Shuttle parking rates to just four bucks. But officials say every dollar the airport loses to off-site parking won't be around for airport improvements. It's the cell phone lot, the rocking chair, it's a mobile an enabled website. Um, the, the, the Wi-Fi inside the building, all those things are about making that customer experience a lot better. The extra money shuttles, taxis, and hotel courtesy cars are about to pay also represents the first rate increase in 21 years. Officials say the new fees are still well below comparable airports like Boise. Eddie, back here on the shuttle, Spotted Road Parking Express feels like the airport is trying to put them out of business, but airport officials say they need to be competitive in the parking business to make enough revenues to maintain the roadways that lead to the airport. The new rate restrictions that go into effect for things like Uber, taxi cabs, and airport shuttles, that happens on July 1st. Reporting live at the airport, Jeff Humphrey, KXLY4. All right, thank you, Jeff.